and show it and you have to explain what it is. Okay? First. This is a screw cart which is used to measure very small units. Yes, it is a screw cart. By adjusting this, you will able to calculate the extremely small units like thickness of a paper or thickness of a coin. Clear? Okay, the next. This is a one year caliper. By this, by this adjusting it, we will calculate the diameter of the circle objects. Yes, by adjusting the screw, we will calculate the diameter or length of the circular object. By placing the object in between and when you are closing it, you will get the exact unit. Okay, this is used to calculate the length of the extremely such circular objects. Okay, next. This is a concave, convex lens. It is thin at the edges and thick at the center. It is, uh, it is positive lens. It is also known as converging lens. It is used to treat uh, hypometropia or long sightedness. Yes, this is a convex lens. You can see that the bulge at the center and thin at the edges. Okay, so this is used to correct hypermetropia that is long sightedness. Okay, this is also called a positive lens. It is otherwise known as converging lens. Clear? The next. It is a concave lens. Its shape is its thinner at the edge in the center and its thicker at the edges. It is used in, used in the short correction of short sightedness and it is uh, folk and it is focal point is negative. Yes. So this is also called as negative lens. It is thin at the center and thick at the edges. Okay. This is used in the correction of short sightedness or myopia. It is also known as diverging lens. Can anyone tell me what kind of lens is in our human eye? Yes, our eye has convex lens. Okay. We have another ability that called the power of accommodation. We were able to see the near objects, also the far objects. Okay, our eye can adjust according to it. Clear? Okay, Gana, thank you. Thank you.